everybody. Bwana Yesu asifiwe. I trust that you're well and keeping well in Jesus' name. My name is Brian Washagadi. I'm coming to you right from Deliverance Church International, Kasarani Zimmerman. And we bless the Lord for this season. We miss you. We are praying for you. And we're really looking forward to seeing you soon. I want to remind you the words of Jesus in the book of 2 Corinthians chapter 4, verse 16 to 18. And I'm going to read. It says, So no wonder we don't give up. For even though our outer person gradually wears out, our inner being is renewed every single day. We view our slight, short-lived troubles in the light of eternity. And he continues, interesting, interesting letter of Paul to the church at Corinth. Listen, he says, no wonder we don't give up, even though on the outside. Actually, the Swahili version renders it very beautifully. It says, iwapo nje tunachaka ndani yetu tunafanywa upia. It's very easy for our physical bodies to feel tired. It's very easy even for our minds to feel really tired in this season, to feel really anxious, to feel like, when is this going to end? We just want to get back to our normal um, programs and businesses and stuff, you know. But Paul says, even though on the outside, and all of this is on the outside, even though on the outside we are getting tired, even though on the outside we are being afflicted, even though on the outside things are not the way we'd like them to be, on the inside there is a greater work that is being done. On the inside we are being renewed. By Jesus we are being renewed. By the power of the Holy Spirit we are being renewed. On the inside there is new life. So he says, so we view all the troubles that we have as light afflictions. It's as if Paul were to say, take all the things you're going through. In this season, for instance, take that rona, take the corona and all the things that are happening, put, place them on one side of the scale. And then on the other side, place the weight of glory. The weight of glory and the view of eternity that we're going, you know, when we have eternity with Jesus, finally when we get into eternity with Jesus, place it on the other side of the scale. It doesn't matter how much our afflictions are, when you place both on that scale, the weight of glory will always, always take the day, always take the day. And that is more than enough reason for us to keep hoping. On the outside, we may be wasting away, but on the inside, we have life, new life, because Jesus Christ is life. Little wonder, he says, in this world, you will face tribulation, but take cheer. Be of good cheer, he says, because I have overcome the world. From me to you, I pray that you'll take some time in this season to just put inside of yourself this mindset that was still in Jesus Christ, that we on the outside, though we may be wasting away, on the inside there is new life, roaring life, the life of Jesus Christ, life in abundance. God bless you. We are praying for you. We look forward to seeing you real soon. Bwana Yesu Abaniki.